This isn't the last you've seen of us on the court. The last time I say it again, it's so good to have you all. You guys are the community, you guys are the culture. I say Audrey, I'm going to be the ISA! Yeah. Welcome to the court, y'all. Today is going to be an insane game. We got the old men with weak knees versus the young people who are going to clean the okay, court. Okay, disclaimer, I'm part of the young group, but my knees are terrible, so well, I don't I'm know. Well, I, I my name's knees. Megan, but I'm no stallion, clearly. Hey, oh my, <laughs> my name's Hudson, but I'm stronger than the river. <laughs> yeah, she had it better. Anyways, <laughs> how are you feeling about the game? Um, I'm, I'm, I'm nervous, nervous for them. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Oh uh, yeah, Thankfully. he's my post. Clearly, yeah. we're yeah, just I'm gonna. Not, I'm gonna sit there and put my hands in the air. Hands up! Talk I'm just gonna you. pass it like Shaq. Kobe, Shaq. Oh wow! Well, Kobe and Shaq. Okay. That's how we do it. That's how we do it. She's going dunk today. She's I know. I've been practicing my entire life for this moment. Mm -hmm. I've been practicing for three weeks straight now. I just gotta say, we had dinner night before, and the trash talk was real. Um, the old men were coming to the young people like just saying shit. So I thought this was a charity game. I thought this was all gonna be for good Funny spirits. Games. These men are out for blood and yeah. these women. You know, Phil actually said if I, I win this game, he's gonna fire me. So, you know, big stakes. Dude, your literal career is on the career's line. On the line here. And I you're gotta, this. I gotta lose. I, I don't know. But. Okay. You know what I will say? We just did a scrimmage match, and Mickey Rye, who has never played basketball apparently, she was like low key she defensive was MVP. Yeah. Turnover queen. I mean, you too. You blocked me, and I was like, oh, I do what I gotta do. Yeah, Are we surprised? Crazy, <laughs> uh, I would have to say, though, on a young person's team, I think we have a little bit of a, a sleeper. Sam Lee. Um, I'm watching him play. Man's not only got handles, he's got his shot on lock, and he can dunk pretty much. So I, I'm looking out for him on the field. Mm -hmm. On the enemy team, they're all kind of old. I'm not sure if they even know where they are right now, so I don't know about MVP, but. I'm saying the underdog sleeper MVP, Sam Lee, I 100%. 100%. All right, there we go. Yeah. There we go. And then, of course, her. You know, she's going to well, I mean, put up some points today, yeah? Let's, let's not. I'm just, I'm just a regular person. A okay. regular person is really like, good I'm at basketball. Just like all of every, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I, I can speak, I, I, this is my first ISA charity game, so the fact that it's one of the last is, is pretty insane to me. And to be surrounded by all of these amazing talents who all know each other and are very familiar, but have been so incredibly kind in welcoming me in and, and making me feel a part of the team, whether or not we're playing against each other, has yeah. been super cool. Hudson, known this guy since 2019. Good to reunite <laughs> with him after, what, two and a half, three, almost two three years? Three years almost, yeah. I didn't go to school, so I can't do math, apparently. All right, come on. Um, <laughs> But yeah, um, I'm super excited. How about you? Let's you take you it know, away. Thank you, thank you. Um, a couple things. One, I did play in one of these games a couple years ago. Probably on the same time we met. Oh, I got word. smoked. Uh, I played against the Cantos. They stole the ball from me. I think Simon did a backflip on me once. Um, so not a great look for me, but this year, I'm hoping to come back with some burning passion. Um, some vengeance. Vengeance, for real. Also, I think one thing I find really interesting about this game is because it is old versus young, it almost feels like a passing of the torch, you know? The old generation of creators and content creators passing on the torch to the next generation of TikTok stars, YouTubers, influencers, actors. It's like, you know, as much as it's a fun game, it's also like, you know, if you win, this is your next step into the world. I don't know. Wow, that's a goes to Harvard thesis answer. That was such a great connection, my guy. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> it's so true that a lot of the Asian American popular media kind of started on YouTube with like Brian Higa, you know, the Wong Fu's, the uh, everybody really. Everyone here today was a part of it. Um, but I feel like recently it really hasn't taken off. We have Simu now, we have all these amazing shows. And it's honestly one thing that's, I, when I first got here, it was kind of like wild to see all these amazingly talented people in one room. Seeing you again, I was like, whoa, it's like, it's just such a small world and it's really great that we're all coming together again. Um, you know, besides that, I feel like it really is just an honor to be part of such an amazing, talented group of people where, you know, I can only see that, like, their futures are brighter than these lights above us, you know? <laughs> They're pretty bright. I can't even see that. I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I would say that I think taking it back to the YouTube days as Asian Americans, I feel like we had to almost create our own content because there weren't that many opportunities out for us in the real world. Um, so it's really beautiful to see all of us come together again at an event that we also created for the people that have supported us from the beginning yes. and seeing us all rise and there and they've been there since day one on the journey, which has been incredible. So I'm really excited for the fans to be here. The fans. We've got such a great turnout. Um, it's and we're doing it for them, and um, it just it goes back to. Day one roots. All right, I'm gonna stop talking because I don't know what nope, I'm saying that anymore. Was as hell. I don't. I don't know what I'm saying. I was like, 
guys should come check out the game. It's going to be yes. intense. As fun and games as this is, it is for charity. We are going to play our hardest here. Yeah, because so, that's how we go how hard we go. all day. Basically, professional athletes now. Like we're getting, we're not getting paid to play, but uh, people were paying to see us play. Unfortunately, Simu couldn't be here, but so we we miss you, Simu. It's okay. We'll, we'll hold up the fort for you. I'm hearing that the teams are going to be older gang versus younger gang, Gen Z versus millennial, 30s versus 20s. There might be some like 19 year olds here. Um, and watching the young guns, they're hungry. We this is our like eighth game, so some of them is their first. I think they want to win. Ooh, Mike, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mike was on my team last game, so we let him have the shine uh, in Toronto. But for this game, unfortunately, he's not on my team. So um, we we have we have some plans. We uh, it's, it's like the Michael Jordan rules, except for the Mike Wu rules. So, yeah, so this is the 10th anniversary of the IC Charity Basketball Game. It's the final one which is very, very nostalgic and bittersweet for me. I honestly, honestly, ISA changed my life personally. Um, when I first moved to LA, they were a big part of shaping who I was in my community here. Uh, and so I hope that the new kids who come into this game can uh, learn from the old, the old guys and we can learn from them as well and just have a good time. But uh, yeah, it's like some of these people here have really paved the way for the success of Asian Americans everywhere. So Asian Canadians, Asian Australians, Asian British people, Asians, Asians everywhere. Young generation, you can say it, the older generation, it's cool. Experience. When we first did the very first game back in 2012, oh my God, like 10 years ago, it really was just another way for us to get the community together, bring like some YouTube creators together and just show that there was like a community around like our work and just, you know, that we were out there. Um, and so, that, you know, over the years we just continued it um, and we have been able to see a lot of new, younger creators come up in that time. Uh, and it's our honor to be able to share this experience with them, share, like, you know, extend that invitation and say, hey, this is, you guys are part of this. You know, we want, we want to send the elevator back down. We want to build the community up. So, um, yeah, really glad that we can have the younger generation here. And, you know, it wasn't going to be this old versus, you know, young thing, but, um, it kind of seemed fitting a little bit, you know, like that we're all here and it really is this mix of different generations. So we'll see how it goes. I got you, Phil. Hold on. <laughs> oh, so, <laughs> so, so, the, so the, the, the rest of the audio is just going to be me. Oh, yeah, ooh. Your head, you got to some Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. Whoa, that's intense. I don't know. We'll see, what, we'll see if we can get some highlights for everyone. I think the point of this game is to have fun and we want to make sure everyone gets some highlights, at least one. So uh, beyond that, you know, once everyone gets theirs, then it's game on. <laughs> um, you know, this is ISA's like farewell game. You know, we're not going to be doing any more under the ISA banner, but I hope that we can continue having these games through a different organization. I think that everyone here still wants to keep going. There's definitely fans that want to keep watching and supporting. So this isn't the last you've seen of us on the court. Uh, what? what? Halo right now, what are you man. About? You're like 60 and looking like this? Dang, you've been around for a long time. I'm when I'm 60 years In YouTube old. years. Yes, in YouTube years. That's what he came back to say. That's what he came back to say. Thanks. Thanks, Steven.
Ready to start? Let's do I'm it. I'm gonna kick it off. All right, let's settle down. Is this cool? Is this cool? Like this? Let's settle down. <laughs> Not yet. Welcome to Meta's fourth quarter shareholders meeting. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. This isn't Meta shareholders meeting because y'all actually look happy to be here. <laughs> oh, I said it. I said it. But let me ask you this. Did I really say it if nobody in the metaverse heard it? <laughs> all right, that's it. That's it. Just a little bit of fun. Just a little bit of fun. That's all I had. Um, starting off with some jokes. <laughs> All right, so what I need right now, I need a co-host. Do I have a co-host in the crowd? Check, check. Whoa, is that, is that Kathy? <laughs> Y'all make some noise for Kathy right now. Kathy Nguyen is in the house. Hello, everyone. Hi, hi, hi. <laughs> Woo, Kathy. Wow. All right, you ready? Look at everyone out here. Well, you're dressed up too, why aren't you playing? Oh, I would, but they said I didn't have enough Instagram followers. Oh. Ooh, I got it, I got it. Yo, I could be a hot pot boy. Yeah, check it out, check it out. Yo, it's your boy, Chris. I'm a hot pot boy. And today we're gonna be dissecting the question, why do so many Asian guys love playing basketball? Dude, it's like, even if they suck, they're like, bull is life. I'm like, bro, you play once a month. This is that stage of every relationship. I call it stage 14. Co-hosting. Co-hosting the 2022 ISA Cherry Basketball Game. Come on, show your love. All right, all right. Thanks to our official media sponsor, Amazing HQ. Damn, we got amazing in the house, okay. Uh, they are a media outlet that provides a platform to our Asian American community's top up and coming sports stars. Make sure you follow them on Instagram and TikTok to see all the highlights from tonight's game. So we want to welcome, Matt. and we would not be here if it wasn't for him and the whole team, but just gonna give a little short welcome. Philip Wang, everyone. Woo! This is such an amazing turnout. Thank you so much for coming out to oh this, this part of the Bay in this weather. It's so amazing to see this kind of um, just this kind of energy and this kind of support for the community. Um, ISA concerts in like 2008, 2009. The whole reason was because we needed, we wanted to create our own spaces. No one was creating concerts or events for Asian American creators, do-it-yourself type of uh, actors and YouTubers and social media people. So we were the ones that set out to try and do that, and prove that there was a community here and there was a, 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 a real desire and enthusiasm to, to see representation in these spaces. And through the concerts, we also ended up doing this basketball game. The first one was in LA in 2012, so it's actually been 10 years since the very first one. Um, and what's crazy is that this is the technically the last ISA basketball game that you guys are here to witness. So I just want to say thank you so much for the last 10 years of, of ISA and, and supporting this uh, this event. Who made game, y'all? OG YouTubers. OG? Burst the 20 year olds. All right, so we've got real stakes on the line, okay? This is basically a mega battle between a bunch of people who went viral 10 years ago and a bunch of people who went viral yesterday. The OG YouTubers, AKA the Super Seniors. <laughs> All right, senior songwriter from Morillo Valley, California, with over one million, one million, one million, one million YouTube subscribers. You can stream his new Christmas single with his wife, Alyssa Navarro, counting down to Christmas, AJ Raphael. Over the past nine years, they've become the guys who always talk about Asian stuff, literally. 
any question or issue about Asian American, any Asian cookie, they probably made a video about it. You know them as the Fun Bros or the Hot Pot Boys, Andrew and David Fo. All right, up next we've got Boston native podcast host at Asian Boss Girl, entrepreneur, digital content creator, and she's a mom, she can do it all, the better and more beautiful half of Phil Wang, <laughs> Helen Woo! We've got Taiwanese American pop singer known from his YouTube channel, Music Never Sleeps. You can find him still actively posting videos, covers, and comedic sketches with his girlfriend, Lucia, Jason Chen! Hey, let's go, super seniors! <laughs> Alright, next we have actor, stuntman, and orange soda enthusiast from Toronto, Canada. You might have seen him in Wong Fu videos, random Canadian TV shows you definitely didn't know existed, and doing too many backflips on social media. His favorite pastimes include taking irresponsible naps and taking video games way too seriously. It's Jason Chan! We've got founder and CEO of Jubilee Media. Jubilee has over Jubilee has over 7 million subscribers and creates shows like Middle Ground, Spectrum, and Odd One Out, all about empathy and human connection. He is from the great state of Kansas. Give it up for Jason Wiley. All right, all right, all right. You may know him as a part of Wong Fu Productions. He's a writer, he's a producer, he's an actor, author, co-founder of Bopo Mofo. He's a husband and number one dad. Should we go on? No stranger to all of us here. It's Phil We know him from popular BuzzFeed show Worth It. He is the co-founder of Watcher Entertainment. It's, and he's also an immortal in Valorant. And by the way, it's his birthday today! Coming straight from the north, standing at six feet under, butcher and He's fresh off the boat, now he's making food. I'm mic'd up. Oh my god. Don't say nothing racial against Indian people, alright? No. <laughs> Yo. 
I like Rishi Sunak a lot. Yo, For you me, know what? It meant a lot to me. To me, garam masala, top five Asian spice of all time. <laughs> The first two cars we're gonna have a good time. Yeah. But I, be, I believe in us. I really, really yeah. do. All right. Let's get where's Jason? Where's Jason? Again, like, yeah, Jason is always. That's his fault. Hey, we got the size. We got the. We got the minds. Yeah. We got the minds. Awesome. Yo, I'm just saying. Still watch the passes. Yeah, right, right, the turnovers right. will kill us. Ready. If you guys have an open shot, just shoot it. Oh, geez, one, two, three. One, two, three. Oh, jeez. Oh, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. Back up, back up. Step up, I got middle, 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 middle. Good. Hey Chill. Yo, Jason. Shoot it. Bust it, David. Oh. Dude, give me show me some. Show me a little something. Got it. Phil. Phil. That's what I'm talking about. Watch out for Edward and his crazy anime rebounds. Shoot him, Mike. Hey, AJ. That's a great start, AJ. Hey, AJ, shoot from the top. Shoot from the top. Oh, that's a good. That's a good pass. Let me see some shakes. Let me see some headsies. Hey, Mike's trying hard to distribute. I see that. I see that, Mike. Oh. 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 strikes and fouls like I see him. The girl on our team is looking like Candace Parker right now. Yo, like Helen is balling out of control. Guys, I should say Skylar Diggins. Listen, like Skylar Diggins. listen, I'm just telling you guys right now, if they want a chance at this, they're gonna have to just 
kind of ball hog it, but ultimately, I'm gonna lock down that ball hog if it comes to it. You pushing it? You pushing it? Oh! Team. I've been quiet, but I got on. Time to go. I did that on purpose. Put it up, put it up. Oh! Our team's on fire. I'm open. I'm wide open. Give me the ball. I got it. Megan's about to hit it. Oh, oh it's close, close, it's close, it's close. All right, nice. defense, y'all. Defense! 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 Good team, good team, good team. Let's go, Mike. It's looking good. What's up, camera? All right. This is from the, the bench warmers uh, interviews. I'm talking to uh, Julie here. How are you playing? I'm playing okay. I got a lot of assists. Who are you talking to right now? Oh, myself. Oh, okay. Yeah, right. I'm a bit delusional. Do you need a pat down? I do. Oh, Can you, you're, you're just a little you got any grapes? Uh, no, I don't have grapes. Fans? Uh, my hand. Thank you, thank you. you, oh, you, 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 you there you go. No, no, one yeah. Yeah. Thank We you, respect thank the younger Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, 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 How you guys feel about the game so far? It's very entertaining. How y'all feeling, Jonas? I'm feeling good. Can I get a cookie? I need to have a great haircut. Thank you, thank you. I did get it today. It's like a be real, be real, be real. I don't, I don't really know how to do it. And me, right? Oh wait, my face. How do I fix this? I wasn't, I'm not used to. All right, I took a new one. Feel good about it right now. I mean, uh. Yeah, we'll see until the fourth. The fourth is when fourth is when it happens. Sorry. Coach. Yes, sir. Your team. Uh, you know, my team is doing great. They I are. think these young guys have no idea what they're doing. Sure, I don't. You see those missies? This is crazy. Embarrassing. The experience is going to win this game. Sure is. Thank you, uh, ISA, for putting this amazing event together, all the amazing sponsors. Um, thank you to Toyota for you know, partnering with this organization and putting, helping put this event together. Um, this is my one day to day one story. Um, 
And you know, I founded Amazing HQ in 2019 as a former Indian American college football player that didn't really have people to look up to. Um, I started this as a way to help tell the stories of our community's you know, top Asian American sports stars and be able to kind of also tell the stories of our trailblazers. Um, we've done a lot in the past two years and we're really trying to change the narrative of you know, what it means to be an Asian American athlete and what, how that affects Asian American identity in our country today. Um, so thank you to Toyota for you know, being here. Um, make sure you, know, you wave around your, the awesome Toyota short shirts that ISA and Toyota has, but appreciate you all. Good shot, yes. 
Yeah. Go. 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 With the rebound. Go. Let's go. Let's go. We got this. That's it. That's it. That's good. I don't know about that. Let him play. What was that? It's passionate. It's passionate. It's good. Huh? This is what we want. It's intramural basketball right here. Maybe, maybe NBA basketball. Who is me? You, I think you have me. I think, I think I, he has me. He has me. Oh! Oh! Get that out of here, Sam! Get that out of here! That's good, that's good. Okay, okay, so. There we go! That's good cut. That's good teamwork right there. It's only three, we're only down three. Oh my goodness! Let's go! There we go, it worked! Who are we playing to again? What are we playing to? 21. 21? Oh man. Go! 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 Okay. Okay. Hey, basketball never sleeps, baby. <laughs> I gotta box it out. I gotta box heads it out. Hey, travel! Travel! Dude, that's definitely a travel. You do not want to be turning to. Oh! Let's go, baby. That is huge. Who's in? Who's in? Who's in? Hey, OG. Uh, yeah. Hey, OG. Uh, OG's on three. OG's on three. Let's OG. try to get a basket. If not, then we'll see what's going on. OG. OG's on three. Watch your three. OG. We'll try this. We'll try this. Hey. 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 Hey.
that was a lot. That was crazy game. Let's go, baby. Good job, good job, guys. Go, Let's go. Woo, woo. Thank you guys so much for being here for the last time, Sam game. So great to have you all. You guys are the community, you guys are the culture. I see all three. Let's go, three. Oh, yes, Shout out to Sam Songley. He's the funniest player oh, listen. Okay. He has the most antics in the Harlem Globetrotters. Sam is going to have an amazing career as an actor, but OG still got it. That was one of the hardest shots I ever hit. Yeah.